Alright, so I'm not going to bore you with all the welding details and all that crap. But here's the pipe. I've got it all uh, set up. You know, when you weld, guys, make sure you get a good helmet, good set of gloves, and cover up so you don't get flash burn. <laughs> I see too many people short sleeving it. Not wearing or one of those Harbor Freight crap helmets. Don't do it. You'll go blind. It ain't worth it. And, uh, you know, get a, get a good pair of gloves, too, so you don't get burned. But, all right, we're going to weld this up, and I'll get back to you in a minute. All right, I just did a couple tack welds just to get it on. Let's see how it fits, and then I'll weld it up. All right, so I got it welded. A little bit of blurble there. Uh, didn't have much of a choice. Had a gap. So... Cause that pipe wasn't you know perfectly round so but anyway it's all flat good to go and we'll get this mounted up in a couple minutes don't mind me just adjusting my uh <laughs> exhaust pipe so this is funny I, I just cut a gasket out for the exhaust and i couldn't find the bolts i was going to use and i looked all over the floor and this is the VNS magnet I have for uh, the implant procedures. And it sucked the bolts up and I'm like looking all over, not seeing them, crawling on the floor. Bam. Yeah. All right. Just funny. All right. So I got it on. Not too bad. And... So get a few heat cycles through this there is a copper gasket in there that i made by the way and uh that's all in so when this gets a few heat cycles through it i'll spray it all down black and then uh, we'll put it back on but uh up here i'm gonna put a mounting clip here and attach it to this bracket oh i had some but they're just too small so Anyways, that's going to be the exhaust. It looks pretty good. Very pleased. Plenty of uh, room from your feet and all that good stuff. So we'll get this all looking good. Sprayed up. And that's it. But yeah, that's one of those little pit bike uh, exhausts. So I got it on there. And funny enough, that little tiny chamber. Well, you got to remember this too with this, okay? This is going to be a low RPM build. It's not a high RPM build, so we don't need a gigantic fat, you know, chamber on this thing. This is like 4,000 RPM, and it's made to put out some super amounts of torque. So that's going to be the goal, but I'll have to get a clip to mount that up at some point. But there's the exhaust, so all right.